Well, there's hope at the end of the fighting in Gaza tonight as Hamas leaders agree to a ceasefire. Israeli officials say they will continue talks while sending troops to the city of Rafah. Now, the news is being watched closely by two Michigan doctors who have risked their lives to save others. Our Josh Sanchez joins us now with more on their efforts. Josh? Sherry Siobhan, Surgeon Dr. Barra Zuhaidi traded his clean operating room earlier this year for a cramped one with limited supplies. He tells me he simply had to go help those in need. Now, Dr. Zuhaidi says in mid-March, he joined other doctors and nurses to make the trip into Egypt and into Gaza, from Egypt into Gaza. He shared videos of buildings left in rubble and roads lined with tents, providing shelter to thousands of people left displaced. Zuhaidi says for two weeks, he operated out of an OBGYN hospital where delivery units were turned into ORs. He tells me one child's story weighs on him the most. As I'm removing my gown, I asked the staff to take me to his family so I can update them about the third finger and how unfortunately we lost finger three, four and five. Everyone stared at me and they said, no one told you? I said, told me what? They said, well, his whole family is wiped out. Thinking that if this was my kid, what would I do? But, and that's the worst part. He doesn't even have a family that you worry about him. They're all gone. Now, Zuhaidi says he owes it to the people of Gaza to share what he saw. He says if given an opportunity, he would go back to help. Now, he's sharing his story tonight at the East Lansing Public Library starting at 7.